Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, as you guys can see by the title and by the thumbnail, we're going to be doing a P. Louise Black Friday haul. And I know you're probably sitting there thinking, girl, Black Friday? Mm, we're kind of lost. So I'm going to be filling you in. Yes, this order was from Black Friday. Actually, before Black Friday, I placed this order on November 9th, 2021, and it just got here today. Girl, so frustrated about this order. I'm going to give you guys all the details and we're going to go through exactly what I got. So I placed two different orders during Black Friday on their website. They had a huge sale, you guys. It was insane. The biggest sale they've ever thrown. And if you did not jump on it, you definitely missed out. Um, so I placed two orders, like I mentioned. The first order was this huge order that I just got in today. Girl, I was in their emails fighting okay because this order was very expensive and this is my hard-earned money that i used on this order and then i placed a second order that i actually got before this one so let's go ahead and jump into it before we jump in please don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up if you guys enjoy makeup hauls don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel if you guys have not already and of course without further ado if you guys want to hear the tea on p louise and my whole unfortunate experience that i had with them and also see what's inside this humongous package then just keep on watching okay let's get into the video you guys when i tell you this you know what let me just tell you okay this is a 400 hundred dollar order girl yes girls and boys four hundred dollars this got lost i don't know how i don't know where but it was supposed to be delivered to where i currently am and the city was the same but it was in the united kingdom so it never left the uk it was delivered to someone in the uk which i don't live in the uk i'm currently in texas and it was a whole hot mess express okay i had to reach out to customer service and let them know that my order was lost and then it took them about almost a week to respond and then after that I basically got an email saying that they, they can either give me a full refund or they can redispatch the order for me. And I said, well, I obviously want my order because that's why I placed it. So I'd like if you can just redispatch my order. Um, you know, I understand it's the holiday season, things happen, you know, packages get lost, no big deal, just as long as you guys can see the proof that it got lost. I never got it. So of course I told them to just resend it out again and I just asked politely in the email like, hey, do you mind maybe sending it express since it wasn't my fault that it got lost and you know, I really want to receive my package. Like this has their new palette launch that they launched for Black Friday and I wanted to do a makeup look for you guys, but I couldn't because I never received the package. So yeah, so I finally got it. Moral of the story, I got it. And you guys, look at this. It's freaking huge. I'm so excited. Like, I am so excited. I have no idea. I've been waiting for this package for two months, basically, for two months. So we're going to open this up. I hope you guys are excited because I am. Let's open this baby up. All right, you guys, I got the box out of the bag. It's a massive box, but I want to show you guys the packaging because it's so beautiful. Their Black Friday packaging, gorgeous. Okay, look at this huge box. Black Friday, P. Louise. This got lost in the mail. And then they got the nerve to ask me, do I want a refund? No, I don't want a refund. I want my makeup. That's why I ordered it. You have to see how messy this box is. It's just like the stuff is just like thrown in here. You guys... If anything is broken in here, I'm going to cry. Anyways, here it comes with this little Black Friday, like, um, it's like right over the products laying like inside of the box. So that's really cute. All right, you guys, I got everything out of the box. Everything is in front of me. So let's jump right into it. So the first thing that I picked up is the P. Louise Brow Balm. This is what the packaging looks like right here. So this is supposed to be the P. Louise version of like your Anastasia brow freeze or like the new brow hold from elf all of those kind of like super like feathered like brow products is exactly what this is here's what the brush looks like right here i really love the p louise packaging because it has that really cute pink handle and it's a really nice cute brush it's nice and tiny and then you have the actual brow balm which i love the container of this and that's why i actually decided to get it i love the packaging it's so cute and when you open it up it's kind of just like a brow balm let's see if i can get it open it honestly just looks like you know when you use like a lip balm and like you rub your finger in there and it looks nice and used and it has like that rounded shape that's exactly what this looks like so again this is the brow balm from p louise so i decided to pick up this 
The next thing that I picked up is the brush set from their new collection, which is the collection that they dropped on Black Friday. And this is called the Ready Set Blend Collection of Brushes. This is what the packaging looks like right here. Really beautiful. Of course, the pink, super P. Louise vibes. And when you actually open it up, it looks like this. So you get a ton of brushes in here. And to be honest, you guys, P. Louise has some really amazing brushes if you follow p louise on instagram if you know who they are and you're familiar with the brand you know that they do those really dramatic sickening eye looks a lot of colorful bold looks which a lot of you guys know are my personal favorites and so of course they have some amazing amazing brushes so if you haven't tried p louise brushes you definitely should because they're so bomb so sticking with brushes for a second i also ordered some singles of their brushes because i have a few favorites so that's what these are but these are what the brushes look like right here so again a really pretty pink handle with a gold ferrule very very cute brushes and most of these are like their blending brushes and i'm obsessed with them i love them so much so i definitely stocked up on these because like i said the entire website was on sale okay so the next thing that i picked up is super exciting i'm very excited for this i actually have to fill it and then i will show you guys what it looks like once i put all the blushes in here but i seen p louise post they have like these big pro products so they have an empty blush palette like this one which is the one that i got and you fill it up with their single blushes but the only thing with this is you have to buy the blush palette separate and then all the blushes individually and they also have a huge one with every single colored eyeshadow they ever launched and i was like mm, i have so many p louise palettes i think i basically have all of them except for two so i was like am i just being dramatic like do i really need to double up on all the shades just because like it's aesthetically pleasing and all the colors are exactly in the right order um so i really wanted it but i was like you know what girl 400 dollars is more than enough money that you spent on p louise so i did decide to get the blush one though because you guys know if you follow my channel i am a sucker for blush so basically like i said it comes like that with an empty palette and then you have to buy these single blushes so like for example i'll show you guys one of the blushes they are to die for you guys look at this shade so beautiful and so vibrant so i'm gonna go ahead and look actually on their instagram to see exactly how they put them in order because i want it to look just like that and then i'll show you guys what the palette looks like all right you guys i went ahead and added all the blushes to the palettes i am obsessed you guys i cannot wait to use this so here's what the palette looks like now with all the beautiful blushes inside i'll go ahead and open it up for you guys so you can take a look i mean are these not the prettiest blushes you've ever seen i did go ahead and just lower the lighting so you guys can really get a full effect of the colors of these they're so beautiful and hopefully my lighting is not too bright you guys i'm still getting used to this new lens so just bear with me i'm just trying to see what works what's not working but yeah i love this like I'm so excited for this and I cannot wait to use it that orange shade are you kidding me have you ever seen a blush this vibrant I mean it's my perfect palette it has my warm tones and my pinks I'm obsessed so I picked up this next I picked up two eyeshadow bases I wanted to also get the original black base because I have every single shade of the P. Louise bases but I didn't have the black one so I ordered the black one and then you guys know I've been obsessed with rumor 2.5 it is my absolute go-to so I decided to actually get the 30 ml size which is the big pro size in the shade rumor 2.5 because I use it for every single look and I felt like I was gonna get such amazing use out of this you guys this is about to last me a lifetime and for this big size i only paid 12 dollars so here's what it looks like right here it's huge let me just compare it for you guys to the rumor 2.5 the regular size so here's the bigger one and here is the original size the size difference is insane so this is gonna last me a lifetime so i picked up this as well all right you guys let's get into some fun stuff you guys already know i got me some eyeshadow palettes so the first one that i have here is from the love tapes collection this is what the palette looks like right here and this one right here is called the vacation palette you guys look at how beautiful oh my goodness you guys already know i'm gonna be bringing you some amazing looks with these palettes this palette is gorgeous you guys look at those tones so gorgeous so i picked up that one here's what the love affair palette looks like also a super beautiful palette i also got the going solo palette and of course like i said these are all a part of the love tapes collection so here's what this one looks like. I think this was the newest one that they launched on that day along with the other palette that I'm going to show you guys. And here's what this one looks like. So it's more of a cool toned, more grayish silver palette. So beautiful and I can't wait to use this as well. If this would have come on time, this would have been the perfect palette to use for a New Year's Eve look. But 
girl I don't know what happened and that's actually the reason why I purchased this palette because I don't really typically use grays or silvers unless it's around that time of year for New Year's but I don't know maybe I'll hold it until next year or maybe I'll just do a look with it anyway the next one that I have here is the wedding wish palette you guys look at how beautiful this is literally the perfect bridal makeup palette it is so stunning such a beautiful neutral look i love the little pop of color with the soft pink it's got shimmers it has your neutrals and it does have a nice amount of mattes which i love typically i feel like for wedding glam brides like to wear more mattes but you have those two shimmers and it's just beautiful such a gorgeous palette and then the last mini love tape palette that i got is the date night palette which i'll show you guys as well and then i do have the original one which i'll show you guys because it's like a bigger palette look at this color story have you ever seen anything like it it is so beautiful and I'm just obsessed. So I got this one as well. And then like I said, let me quickly just show you guys what the original Love Tapes palette looks like because I got it when it actually launched. It's actually sitting back there on my shelves in the packaging because I love P. Louise packaging and it goes with my decor. But let me quickly show you guys this palette in case you have not seen it before because it's beautiful. It's definitely a gem to have. So it's literally like a Love Tape. So beautiful. This is what it looks like right here. I don't know if this palette is still available. Um, I'm going to link P. Louise's website down below in case you guys are interested. But again, none of this stuff is on sale anymore. So, I mean, but I'm still going to link it down below in case you guys are interested. You don't have to buy every single product you see in today's video. Maybe one or two items caught your eye. So here's what the original Love Tapes palette looks like. It actually came with two highlighters and then a ton of eyeshadows. So beautiful. I have one more product to show you guys in this haul. And that was the brand new Watch the Queen Conquer palette, which actually inspired this entire haul. This is what it looks like right here. This is the collection that they launched on Black Friday. You guys, when I started to see campaign photos for this on Instagram, I was shook okay it looks so beautiful and so many of you guys hit me up in my dm like girl are you buying it i can't wait to see you use it and i've gotten a few comments on youtube too asking me if i purchased this palette the answer is yes i will be of course bringing you guys makeup looks more than one with this eyeshadow palette because it is so beautiful i was honestly just waiting for it in the mail so this is what it looks like once you go ahead and take it out of the box so this palette is super cool because it actually opens up to a full chessboard you guys look at this so freaking cool this is so innovative and then you can actually close it up and it looks like a little book and there's actually two eyeshadow palettes in here so it has two sides so let's get into the first side this is the first time that i'm opening this palette oh my gosh you guys it's so beautiful so here's what the first side looks like it's filled with beautiful pinks purples shimmers mattes oh my gosh you guys are so beautiful i am gonna go ahead and show you guys the palettes up close and a little bit more of low lighting so you can really see the shades and then you have the other side, which is my personal favorite side, and I cannot wait to use this palette. Here's what the other side looks like. I mean, have you ever seen a palette this beautiful? It is so stunning. The greens in here are sensational. So like I said, I'm going to show you guys these palettes up close. They're just so beautiful. You have your mattes, you have your shimmers, you have your side with your pinks and your purples. Then you have the beautiful greens and chartreuse shades. I am just over the moon for these shadows. So along with the eyeshadow palette and the brush set that I actually showed you guys in the beginning of the video, they also launched four loose pigments with this new collection. And here's what they look like right here. I'm not going to go ahead and open them up because I am going to use them in a video. But they're basically like duo chrome pigments. That's what they look like in the actual container. So we're definitely going to use those in a video as well. But that basically completes this Black Friday P. Louise haul. This is everything that I got minus the stuff that I showed you guys over on Instagram but I'm super excited down below in the comments let me know please you guys let me know what you guys want to see in action in videos do you want to see the blush palette do you want to see any eye looks using any of the eyeshadow palettes that I showed you today I will already tell you spoiler alert I am going to do a review and some looks with this palette both the purple side and the more green side so you guys don't have to leave me comments about that because I already know you guys want to see some makeup looks with this eyeshadow palette so that basically concludes today's video thank you guys so so much for watching and of course as always i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys